this is going to be your daily for June 11th going into the 14th. So we're going to get right into it as we usually do. We're going to check on the energy decks over here. We have the chakra deck and we have the oracle deck. And then we'll get into the tarot to get specifics, okay? If you need a personal reading for me, you can check out the link in the description below. You'll be able to book a reading with me um, by going to my website. Um, that's really it. <laughs> So let's get into what's going on between you and your partner energetically from uh, June 11th to the 14th, okay? It's one of the fire signs and your partner. All right, so we have forgiveness, okay? So we're still going through this um, end of a cycle energy for you guys, fire signs, because I've been seeing this for a while, either end of a cycle between you and a specific person Okay, this could be pertaining to your partner. Okay, um, if it's not an end of a cycle, then there's definitely a need for forgiveness. Okay, in the in the situation, so you two may not be speaking to each other because of something that happened. Um, confusion is at the bottom of the deck, so I feel like there was some type of mis like misunderstanding, um, or someone has wronged someone. Pretty much, maybe someone was creating confusion in the connection. Um, this could have been on purpose. Okay, <clears throat> I feel like one person feels like wronged though between you and this person fire sign. I feel like one person feels like they were um, tricked in some way or purposely confused. Okay, like made to like basically led on like um, either you or this person is like I didn't get these feelings from anywhere. I kind of you know, got the impression that we were doing something, we were going somewhere with this connection, you were making it seem like we were going somewhere with this connection. Um, I feel like that was a past energy though. I feel like uh, right now, because your last daily, um, well, the last daily that I posted so far, there's still some dailies in between, but the last one I remember posting was about an apology for you guys. So this definitely would make sense with forgiveness. So there may have been an apology that came through that you weren't really feeling. Um, this doesn't have to happen exactly around this time. It doesn't have to be these days, but it can happen around this time. Um, but basically, I felt when I saw the apology last time, it was a page of cups. So it was like a lot of you were just going to be like, mm. <laughs> Yeah, your apologies weak, bro, or <laughs> or the Page of Cups is still that energy that they were giving you before, which is that energy of confusion, or it's not a solid offer. It's like, I like you, but I'm not getting a solid commitment like the Knight of Cups or the King of Cups. So that energy may have continued, and now for some of you, you have an, uh, a choice of whether you want to forgive this person or not, all right? Okay, so I am feeling that one person feels more wronged than the other one whether that's you or this other person i'm seeing the need for forgiveness in a situation period okay and the main thing was there was confusion and i feel like the confusion was over feelings okay someone was purposefully not revealing their true feelings or basically leading someone on without verifying how they feel back about that person okay so let's see what's going on with the energy oracles for you and your partner all right, we've got the second chakra, um, Angel Ariel. And we have anxiety at the bottom of the deck. So, okay, if you are not speaking to someone, all right, we have two nines here. Three, six, one, and eight, okay? Some of you could be dealing with the Libra. The Angel of Balance is here at the bottom of the deck. Anxiety and sacral chakra. So there's definitely for some of you out there, not all of you, some of you could be dealing with an earth energy um, or fire energy. <clears throat> could also be water as well because I'm seeing some emotional energy here, but mainly earth sticks out to me. There's definitely someone's issues with money or finances. Okay, this could, could pertain to the relationship. Um, this could be something that you or, or your partner are stressing over fire signs, but I'm definitely seeing someone stress over money, okay? Um, I also feel like if you two aren't speaking, like this this person, or you, you and this person fire sign, I'm feeling like a lot of anxiety from not speaking to each other. Like, yeah, the two are not liking it. You guys have a strong connection. Sacral chakra is where you two are connected. So it could be like a soulmate at least, all right? 
but there's a lot of anxiety. Someone wants to bring balance back into the connection, angel balance, which to me would be an apology or forgiving someone. But someone is like this. I don't know if I want to go back into this. Either the person needs to apologize. I don't, need, I don't know if I need to. I don't want to. I don't know if I want to go back towards the fire sign and apologize. Or this could be you, fire sign, saying I don't know if I want to accept the apology, or vice versa. Okay, but it's like the longer you two don't talk, the more clear it becomes that you two miss each other and you have a connection and all that great stuff. Okay, because separate sacral chakra and anxiety is telling me that you're feeling this anxiety on a deep level. Okay, not just in your mind, but in your soul. You feel it intuitively that you know you're missing this person or having anxiety over the fact that it could be actually over between you two. All right, so two cards just flew out for your partner already, fire sign. So we have two cards on the table for your partner already. We're going to take them. All right. So basically, uh, you, you're both, I feel like, maybe feeling like it's over, worried that it's over, or someone's very concerned with money. All right. the same card back in and it came out again so it was meant to come out all right <clears throat> all right so the interesting thing is this definitely has a lot of synchronicity synchronicity in these cards okay so for your uh, partner's energy fire sign let me could be dealing with a water sign we have the knight of cups pisces cancer scorpio could be aries sagittarius or leo as well you are, your partner is thinking about commitment, okay? We have the uh, Knight of Cups as their thoughts, okay, and their feelings. So they definitely are thinking about commitment. They're definitely thinking about a higher level of commitment between you two. The Knight of Cups is what we're looking for, right? Remember I was talking mess on the one reading. It was on the third to the sixth um, fire sign reading, I believe. I want to say yeah. It was the third to the sixth, and I kept saying, well, Fire signs ain't gonna want no page because this person was coming in as a page to apologize about whatever behavior that they were exhibiting before. I'm pretty sure it had a lot to do with that confusion card that came out the deck. Um, but this person wants to come and make you an offer with the Knight of Cups. That's what their thoughts are. But the thing about this is we also have full card at the bottom of the deck, so they definitely want to take a risk. But they're hanged for some reason. So let's see why they have the hangman. A lot of you, when the hangman shows up, I feel that means they have another relationship they need, they need to get rid of, okay? This could be romantic, family, whatever this other relationship is, or it's a job. There's something that they're not sacrificing, <coughs> but um, and that's why things are hanged, okay? So we've got the Empress, and we've got the Nine of Wands. So for some of you, they can have a Taurus that they're dealing with, a Libra, okay? could possibly be another Leo. Um, definitely seeing the lover's card here. So I'm definitely seeing a possible married person that you're dealing with, someone that could be married or have some type of relationship, nine of wands, empress. It's something that they um, need to let go for the most part. I'm definitely seeing another relationship here if the person is married, okay? Or if it's not a marriage situation, they're not married, maybe someone has, um, issues with commitment because I'm seeing the nine of wands over the empress which is like um guarded being very guarded against commitment so this could be a Taurus or someone who has issues with commitment Gemini is also here as well but with the lover's card coming out whether they're married to this other person or not they're definitely feeling like another person involved okay so that's why if you haven't heard from your partner yet um even and and like you're hearing the other readings where it's like oh they're gonna apologize oh they're gonna they, they may be thinking about an apology. Um, they're also thinking about stepping it up because we were getting a page of cuts before, but they may have another person. And they, that could be why you two aren't speaking already. So there's no way that they're going to be able to come back to you, Fire Sign, in the same predicament that they were in before you two started talking. Stop talking. Sorry. So what are you going to do with this Knight of Cups? I'm sorry. I'm already clarifying because I want to know. 
All right, so we've got the Five of Pentacles and the Page of Wands, okay? So they want to they want to talk. This is the same, the page, is, the page of Wands is also a message, okay? Just like the Page of Cups. So they want to hit you up, particularly fire signs, because the Page of Wands could be a fire sign, um, and the Five of Pentacles. So it could be money constraints that are have them not, you know, not hitting you up. Like I know I, I, I haven't got my money together yet, so I can't really hit fire sign up yet. Or they're just feeling like they missed communicating with you. The Five of Pentacles is an energy of missing um, someone. It's also communication that's missing. So they could be feeling the effects of not talking to you. Okay. Um, some of them that could have a child and that could be a problem, like an issue would be a boy child specifically. Maybe they have financial obligations um, surrounding a boy child. All right. I'm going for this Five of Pentacles. I feel like they know if they if they message you and make this offer that things are going to change for them specifically uh, a lot and they're not ready for that. Let's see. What's this about? Five of Pentacles. One. <coughs> star card yeah they're just sitting over here missing you so y'all got someone over here it could be an Aquarius somebody's over here missing you but they have another person for the most part or some type of obstacle in their way it could be a mother figure job but I really feel like it's a person okay now with your energy here fire signs we have the page of Pentacles and the Queen of Cups okay so again water sign energy showing up Capricorn energy it has at the bottom of the deck currently with this page of Pentacles it could be Taurus Capricorn or Virgo as well so you are, someone maybe, like I said, with this page of pentacles, you could have received an apology or an offer already. Um, you're thinking about it with the page of pentacles as your thoughts and feelings. You may also be thinking about reaching out to them because they haven't reached out to you, for some of you. Um, the queen of cups and the outcome tells me that some of you may take the compassionate route and decide to message this person first, even though, um, <clears throat> I mean, personally, I think they should message you, but some of you may decide to message them. All right, specifically water signs. You may decide to message them. Queen of Pentacles. Some of you have received a mess, uh, uh, an offer from an earth sign, or you're waiting to receive an offer from an earth sign. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo with the Page of Pentacles. So this could be an apology. It could be a uh, offer of love, a commitment, ring, whatever. That's the Page of Pentacles. It's going to be a few things. But, okay, and the Ace of Cups. So, yeah, some of you are looking for a new relationship with an Earth sign. Okay, Page of Pentacles could be an Air sign, Page of Swords. Or you're looking for communication that starts a new beginning. Why is the Queen of Cups in the outcome here? Why is the Queen of Cups in the outcome here? If you have already received this offer from someone, I feel like a lot of you should just be patient and wait for this person to come in with some type of solid offer. Okay. The Queen of Cups is the outcome. So the Queen of Cups is giving her cup. So some of you may decide to go ahead and give this person your cup, you know, after they've apologized or made an offer. Some of you may decide to go ahead and be with this person. All right. Nine of Pentacles, Seven of Cups, and then and the Queen of Cups. Some of you may take your time, though. You may not make a decision about this until about July. I feel like uh, there's a few of you that have multiple options, okay? Um... I have pentacles and the seven of cups. Yeah, some of y'all have a lot of offers, like a lot of different people, like not in a bad way. You just may be dating. Um, some of you may decide to also stay single and keep your options open with the nine of pentacles and the seven of cups. If it's a water sign that you're already committed to, fire signs I'm seeing possibly becoming single from a water sign. So that could also, if, if that's what's hindering you from being with someone that you want to be with, you could decide to leave that alone. Give me one more. Some of you are dealing with cancer. Five of swords. Okay, so yeah, some of you are going to decide to stay single and not make, um, and not go right with this person right away. I'm seeing some resistance here. Even though you want to give this person your heart, um, I'm seeing some resistance here. Five of Swords, Knight of Pentacles, and then the Ten of Pentacles. So eventually, I do feel like you're going to wind up being with this person over here, especially with the Ten of Pentacles coming out. But I think you're either going to be resisting it, um, you want to keep your options open, you're going to be very slow to go into this connection with this person, mainly probably because of whatever the hell they were doing before, whether it be a third party or just avoiding commitment. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, five of cups. 
two of wands. I don't see you just, yeah, eventually five of cups, two of wands, two of cups. Eventually you will, you will accept this person's offer. Okay, but you're gonna take, uh, it really depends on how long this person takes to come in. Cause you, they definitely have you in your feelings and you definitely want to give them your love. But I feel like there's, um, some of you, maybe you've been enjoying being single, okay? Um, they left you too single too, you, they left you single too long and you've just been enjoying dating and you're gonna keep your options open until you're ready, okay? Or they may have had too many options. There's a lot of different ways that this could come in, okay? So I feel like you, some of you may resist this person, but eventually I see you coming back with this person, okay? Um, it just depends on what type of offer they're coming in with. If they're coming in with a very small offer, I just don't see fire signs being receptive to that right now, okay? Um, they're looking for Page of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, a strong offer, okay? Page of Pentacles, to me, what the Queen of Pentacles means that, you know, you've received a page type of offer, and maybe you want a Queen of Pentacles offer, which is really commitment stability okay whether it could be from the earth sign or not okay so that's why i'm seeing things for you fire signs i hope that this daily helps um it is seeming to follow some type of chronology chronological order or like a storyline to me so if you have been going this you know storyline has been resonating with you i really feel like it's going to continue to resonate with you throughout june okay so make sure you subscribe if you want to see more dailies again if you want a personal you can check out the link in the description below okay bye fire signs see you